everybody, it's me James again, Perkins Life 4, and I have another um, meal idea. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to make um, my version of a Sloppy Joe. So this is one of those where um, if you're going to, if you're like in the mood for Sloppy Joe and you just have ingredients around the house but you don't have the sloppy joe stuff this is a way that you can make it without having the can of sloppy joe so here we go first thing i got over here is in the pot here i've got about two pounds of ground meat that i got the other day here's some onions i'm gonna chop these onions up real quick And I like mine fairly good size. You know, and this is, you don't have to put these onions in there. You can even put those little dried onions in there if you like them a little bit smaller. But I like to have a little bit of onion in mine. All right. Put my onions in. And if you do notice, I do have my rag underneath. And that rag, you know, remember it prevents it from sliding too much. So we're going to head over to the stove and we'll get over there. What I like to do too is I get, uh, we have a big whisk and I like to do, and it's just, just kind of chops it, that meat up a little bit, you know. As soon as it's done, I'm going to take it and I'm going to strain it, and then I'll add my other stuff in there that I need to add to it. Alrighty, so I drained my meat. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a can of tomato sauce. I'm going to add some Worcestershire sauce and you can add as much of this as you want I'm going for maybe between a quarter of a cup and maybe a half a cup and then you're gonna add some ketchup it's about a half a cup of ketchup stir this around Turn this down. a little bit of it don't really want a lot of meat on there but just kind of just enough to get a little sauce on there just to kind of taste it might add a little bit more garlic to it That's about it. That's all I need to add to it. So I'm going to let this now go. I'm going to take this and I'm going to actually put it on. Um, I'm going to simmer it with a lid. And I'm going to let it simmer for about, probably about, a, I don't know, 30 minutes to an hour, somewhere right in there. And then it'll be ready to serve. So I'll bring you back then. Okay, so we're back. It's been... Probably roughly about, you know, 45 minutes to an hour. This has just been simmering this whole time. Look at that. Mmm. So I'm going to fix plates. 
Now, you can have this any way you want it. You can have it on hamburger buns. You can, uh, Atia and Truck like to have it on rice. And tonight what they're gonna want is they want the leftover mashed potatoes. I don't, I don't, I don't know. Don't ask me why, but they want it on top of their mashed potatoes. So I'm gonna put it on top of their mashed potatoes. So put my mashed potatoes down there. And there we go. Let's go take this over here to Tatia. Tatia. Wow. Atia. Let's grab her a fork. There you go, dear. A little warm. Good. Good. All right. So now, get back over here, and we're gonna make Crook's plate. See if I can set you up over the, like this for right now. Oh, camera down, camera down. All right, now we're gonna set up Chuck's plate. He wants the mashed potatoes. Which works out good because this uses up the mashed potatoes. And then we'll put some of this right here on there. There we go. So, truck, get your fork. It's hot, so we'll come back to you in just a second. Let it cool down a little bit. So let's fix uh, Tyler's now. Tyler is going to be normal. Normal. <laughs> okay, we got we can get Tyler's done. I got him his two burgers. Miss Lewis. A couple scoops on there. And then here on Tyler's, I am going to add, this is the way I like it too, so mine will look just like this piece of cheese. All right. Tyler, come around here. All right, truck, it's probably cooled down enough, so. No way. No way. <laughs> Delicious. Delicious. All right, let's get over here. Let's see if I can get it. It's going to be sloppy and messy and hot. <laughs> I taste good. <laughs> you forget what hot meant? Mm -hmm. It's good, though. 
It's good though. <laughs> All right. All right. So there you go. There's a um, my version of a homemade sloppy joe. So thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and we will see you later.